a sans bug tent. It's a bug tent that pops open and keeps you from getting eaten alive by mosquitoes. And it worked really well for us here in the Grand Tetons. It was very buggy all day, all evening. Um, the kids hung out in the tent while we sat around. So it was wonderful. So what you see out here is the one person. Uh, and there's two styles of that one. There's the poly floor and the tarp floor. I uh, will show you those pictures more in detail. I'm going to show you how to open up. This is a three person, so it's much larger. Make sure you never have kids do this part because it flips open really fast. So sometimes it has a strap as long as you remember to put it away with the strap. And I just lost the tent. Here's a three person. Up. This one has a zipper on both sides. Plenty of space in there. I think all four of us could easily fit into this one. Um, super lightweight. They're pretty, pretty packable. Um, especially if you got a kid, older kid hiking with you. They do have shoulder straps, so you can sl sling it on your back if you know you're going somewhere that's pretty buggy. Perfect mosquito and other bug protection. We love these things. We've spent probably 10 hours in the last two days. Our kids have spent hanging out in these, doing puzzle books and reading and just hanging out. They're a lot of fun. Back them up is pretty simple too. Bring all the uh, pieces together. There's two ways you can do it. Um, this is the first way. It gets it so that the strap can go around if you're just storing it how we've been storing it underneath our camper while we're out and about during the day in the Tetons. And so I just kind of keep it out of your way. And then you can fold it down a little bit smaller, one more twist, and you can put it right back in the bag. And you're off and running on your next adventure. So they do come with 10 stakes as well as a tie-down strap. Um, and there's little hooks around the end of each side, just like a normal tent. Slide on in there. And that'll hold it down nice for you. We feel that the Sands Bug tent is like the perfect fit for our family. Anytime that we needed to get the kids out of the way in our small little camper, uh, we only have a little 17 foot camper, we would just pop one of those up and they would go out to take their books, their tablets, whatever they had on hands and toys, and they would spend an hour in there and be totally out of our way. We could get cleaning done, cooking done. It really was a lot of fun. Unlike other tents that you have to either attach to trees or find a way to stake to the ground, this pop-up tent is perfect because within a matter of seconds, it's up, it's available. You could weigh it down with people or with um, gear. You can tie it down if you'd like, but it's super fast, super easy to use. The two different floor styles include a tarp floor, which seemed to us to be a little more sturdy, um, industrial, kid-friendly. And then there's a softer poly floor, which um, we liked as adults better. We felt it was more comfortable. However, uh, we could see that if you're in a location that has a lot of sticks or pine cones or things, uh, this probably wouldn't be the best choice. But on the beach, I think this would be a really, really good option. Um, whereas the tarp would be a really good one to have in the deep woods where you might have things that might be poking into the bottom of your tent. We'd like to send a super special thank you to Sandsbug, also the Hakuna Matata Tent Company, for getting in contact with us and letting us test out these uh, bug tents. These are amazing and I think every family should have at least one. Um, the three person easily could have held four of us having a picnic, uh, probably for sleeping, two to three people would be really nice. The one person, even a parent and child could easily sleep in together. 
They're roomy, they're beautiful, and they kept out all the mosquitoes.